Turkey has entered a defining era in its defense modernization strategy with the commencement of mass production for its most ambitious and technologically advanced platform to date, the Kizilelma unmanned fighter jet. Developed by Baykar, a cornerstone of Turkey's growing defense industry, the Kizilelma marks the culmination of years of engineering, research, and flight testing. It represents not just a leap in military capability, but also a demonstration of Turkey's growing autonomy in high-end aerospace manufacturing. The program's shift from prototypes to full-scale production is a milestone being celebrated not only in Turkey but also by observers worldwide who view it as a disruptive entry into the next generation of combat aviation. The Kizilelma, meaning Red Apple in Turkish, carries deep cultural symbolism in Turkish history, referring to an ultimate and sometimes mythical goal. In the context of Turkey's defense ambitions, it represents a vision of self-sufficiency, advanced capability, and strategic resilience. Its development has been a centerpiece of Turkey's push for indigenous systems, reducing dependence on foreign suppliers while building a platform that matches or surpasses existing global alternatives. The jet has been designed to execute missions traditionally reserved for manned fighters, such as air dominance, precision strike, deep interdiction, and suppression of enemy air defenses, but with the unique advantage of eliminating pilot risk. From a technical perspective, the Kizilelma introduces a range of advanced features that place it at the forefront of unmanned combat aerial vehicle UCAV, design. Built with stealth as a priority, the aircraft has a low radar cross-section and is designed to operate effectively in contested airspaces. It is capable of high subsonic to supersonic speeds, depending on engine configuration, and can launch from both conventional runways and Turkey's newly commissioned TCG Anadolu amphibious assault ship. This naval compatibility gives it a significant force projection capability, allowing Turkey to extend its air power beyond national borders and into regional theaters of operation. The Kizilelma is also engineered for multi-role versatility. It can be configured for air-to-air -air combat, precision ground strikes, electronic warfare and reconnaissance missions. Its internal weapons bay allows it to carry guided missiles, air-to-air -air weapons and smart bombs, preserving stealth during operations. The advanced avionics suite integrates seamlessly into network-centric warfare environments, enabling the Kizilelma to coordinate missions with other UCAVs, manned aircraft and ground-based command centers. Its autonomous flight capability, supported by advanced artificial intelligence, means it can adapt to rapidly changing combat conditions, making it a true force multiplier on the battlefield. Mass production of the Kizilelma is not only a strategic military decision but also an economic and industrial one. The program will be executed with the involvement of Turkey's extensive domestic defense supply chain, creating a significant boost for local manufacturing, technology transfer, and skilled employment. Baykar has emphasized that the production process will leverage an extensive network of Turkish companies specializing in avionics, propulsion, composite materials, and weapons integration. This collaborative industrial approach ensures that the program benefits the broader national economy while maintaining tight control over intellectual property and technological sovereignty. The strategic implications of the Kizilelma's mass production are profound. The global military landscape is witnessing a rapid shift toward unmanned and autonomous systems, with their flexibility, endurance and cost-effectiveness reshaping the way nations approach air combat. For Turkey, fielding a high-performance UCAV like the Kizilelma enhances deterrence, improves strategic depth and expands operational options. When integrated into the Turkish Armed Forces alongside platforms such as the Bayraktar TB2, Akinci UCAV, and the TCG Anadolu, the Kizilelma will provide an unprecedented layered capability that spans intelligence, surveillance, strike, and air dominance. The export potential of the Kizilelma is another factor generating considerable interest. Several nations have already expressed curiosity about the platform, drawn by its advanced capabilities, indigenous production and competitive cost compared to Western alternatives. While no official export deals have been announced, the aircraft's performance during demonstrations and trials has positioned it as a highly marketable defense product. This mirrors the trajectory of other Baykar platforms such as the TB2, which gained international recognition and export success after proving its effectiveness in various operational theaters. In the broader geopolitical context, the Kizilelma symbolizes Turkey's ascent as a serious player in advanced aerospace technology. Its successful production and deployment could alter regional air power balances, especially in regions where traditional manned fighter fleets dominate. By developing a stealth-capable, carrier-compatible UCAV, 
Turkey is signaling to allies and adversaries alike that it intends to maintain a decisive technological edge. The Kizilelma's ability to operate in high-threat environments, survive modern air defense systems, and deliver precision strikes at range makes it a formidable addition to Turkey's arsenal. Beyond immediate military applications, the Kizilelma program is expected to serve as a foundation for future innovations. Research and development efforts associated with the jet are likely to drive advances in artificial intelligence, propulsion, materials science, and autonomous systems that could spill over into both military and civilian sectors. Baykar has indicated that future iterations of the Kizilelma may include enhanced engines, longer ranges, greater payloads, and increased speed, potentially even entering sustained supersonic regimes. As the first mass-produced units roll off the production line, attention will turn to operational deployment. The Turkish armed forces are expected to begin integrating the Kizilelma into active squadrons, with initial missions likely focusing on strategic deterrence, border security, and carrier operations. Over time, the platform will likely expand its role to encompass international exercises, peacekeeping missions, and if necessary, combat operations in active theaters. For Turkey, the Kizilelma is not just an aircraft, it is a statement of national capability, ambition, and resilience. As the program moves forward, its success will be measured not only by its battlefield performance but also by its impact on Turkey's defense industry, export markets, and strategic standing. The beginning of large-scale production marks the dawn of a new era in Turkish air power, one in which unmanned systems will play an increasingly dominant role in safeguarding the nation's interests and projecting its influence.